So the computer is ready for big upgrades in the future. That's what I want to say. Yeah, I tried to butcher the CPU with an RTX 2060 Super, but apparently it didn't want to take it. So I downgrade the GPU just a little with 1650 because uh, it doesn't need it. I'm gonna test some games again and see how it's running. All right, fam, let's play some games with this i3 second gen. How we doing? 720p performance mode we got our uh, render, 3d render scale <sighs> gonna play like this seriously <sighs> not gonna lie this doesn't look good seriously the gtx 1650 barely managed to be utilized memory user 28 <laughs> percent oh no it doesn't care it really doesn't care about the cpu seriously <laughs> but the look at the cpu is barely barely managed to keep up Bit spiky, not gonna lie. It's running 720p, it's the real deal. Wow, he went on a pig with it. What the? F All right. <gasps> 36 FPS on high detail, DirectX 11. Oh my God, the CPU. GPU memory usage 91%. Wow. I mean, DirectX 11 though, it looks really, really, really good. Oh my God, it looks so nice. I wanna see an average of low, I wanna see an average of low FPS because the density of the cars is on high. Now, theoretically, that would make everything go laggy. Let's see how we can improve this because this is. So I'm thinking I'm gonna put 50% render scale. Keep the settings. Yep. So the render scale is half, and it's still. Right. Doesn't make any sense. Let's stop. We're parking here, yeah? On the curb. This is very Romanian parking. Graphics. All right, let's put it on the lowest resolution, 800 by 600. On the lowest resolution, 800 by 600, the VRAM is still 88%. And the FPS is still with 50% render skill. This is not the GPU. <laughs> <laughs> this is the CPU. You can't play GTA 5 with this. I'm sorry. Look at this. I want to just jump in and see how we can make the game run really nice. Ambient collision off. Ultra performance. See how we can 23 FPS. CPU load 96, 100%. Not funny. I cannot play cyber twat with this. Nothing. This is the GTX 1650. Last time we played, we, we actually tried the ray tracing with it and the computer exploded. <laughs> Shut it down. Now we don't have ray tracing, but it does look like crap. The point was that with that uh, RTX to see if DLSS would be much better than FSR, you know? But that's it. This is what I can do with Cyberpunk. You understand? There is nothing you can do. He lags. He looks horrible. This is not a good CPU. This is not the game for this CPU, you understand? Look at that, how slow it fucking renders. 
That's not the hard drive because the game is on an, on an SSD. You understand? Wow. Look at that. Uh, dun, 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 dun. 720p graphics, render scale two chunks, everything it's on minimalistic. The lag is real. Ah, oh, wow, wow, Minecraft. What the f Not even in Minecraft you cannot run with this potato. What the boy? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Yo, 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 yo. I don't think I have a chance. Maybe in a cave it's much better. In a cave. Yes, in the cave is better. I think that world is sh The moment I go between bushes and trees like this, I'm f very bad minimal. Oh, 1%, 13, minimal, 4. The lag is real. Can I eat mushrooms? No, I cannot eat mushrooms. Right. Let's uh, settings the shit out of this game. Display Nvidia borderless. Let's lower the resolution here. How much we can lower? 800 by 600. Borderless, yes. Nothing. <laughs> 25 FPS. <laughs> oh my God. It's still, oh. Still like. Andrew, 720p. Let's try 720p. Hey, he runs the game. He runs the game. It's not playable. He runs the game. Very scary that the game is running. You know, I can imagine how it will run with a four core CPU. It would be much better if I had just 15, 20 percent from that CPU load off, it would be fantastic. I think I had better frame time. But on 720p, the game runs. It's not playable, it runs. <gasps> Is there something you can do to the CPU? No, maybe some overclocking, maybe. But this is another video card that shows that the CPU it's uh, not um, quite the right deal if you want to play new games. There's a lot of games that I can play on this CPU and this combination, but it needs to be a bit older. There needs to be an older system, an older combination. It, how should I say? The GPU is not important. It's the games that you throw at the CPU. I'm thinking about some games like um, World of Tanks, Dota, League of Legends, Valorant. Games that are not CPU demanding. Everything, every game that is under 2010, I think it will be a great choice for the CPU. And the GPU, it doesn't matter. It really doesn't matter. The moment you can make the CPU not being bottleneck, with those application and games, I think it's golden. Aside from that, can't wait to upgrade it. I could upgrade the CPU because it's a pain in the ass, the CPU. Nevertheless, I think for emails, YouTube, office work, I think this is a good uh, way to build a computer.